And now we have a nice looking hilly landscape. In the previous video we created this terrible looking landscape, but in this video we will make it look appealing using pearly noise. Let's go! Now we just take random heights in some range to generate our terrain, but it looks ugly. So to make it more beautiful we can use pearly noise. That's how pearly noise looks like. Let's say each pixel is the point of our landscape and the wider the pixel, the higher will be the point. For example, in this area there will be a mountain and in this area there will be a field. And that's basically how it works. Let's implement this in code. Firstly, we need to add the Perlin Noise plugin to our project because Unreal doesn't have a native Perlin Noise 2D blueprint function. To do this, go to your project root folder, then uh, create a new folder and uh, call it plugins. After that, follow the link that will be in the description below. Click on UE5 Perlin if you are working with Unreal Engine 5 and just press download. After the downloading is completed, go to the plugins folder and uh, extract uh, this to that folder. Now you can run your project, click yes and uh, Unreal successfully opened. Then we need to go to our terrain blueprint. Let's uh, remove these nodes and uh, use uh, 2D Perly Noise function instead. We need to pass our x and uh, y variables to this function. And uh, also I want to print our height value on the screen, so I will add the print string uh, function. Compile, save, go back to the scene. I will set the y size to 100, click play and you can see that uh, our height is uh, always zero. So nothing works. This happens because Perly noise function returns a value between 0 and 1 and because for integers Perly noise always returns the same value. Let's fix these issues. So firstly we need to create a new variable called Z multiplier and multiply our function result by this value. Secondly, we have to add uh, 0.1 to our x and y variables, so they are not integers. Compile save, back to the scene. I will set that multiplier to 1000, click play and as you can see now our heights are different. But our terrain is very rough and uh, if we for example want to create smooth hills this result won't be suitable for us. So why the terrain is so rough? Let me show. You see two purling noises but the one on the left has a scale of 1 and the one on the right has a scale of 10. Because our terrain also has a scale of 1, heights of vertices are very different as you can see on the left image. So to solve this issue we need to increase the scale. Let's go back to our code. Now we have to create a new variable called noise scale. And then pass it to the scale pin. Compile save. Set noise scale to 10 for example. Hit play. And now we have a nice looking hilly landscape. By the way, if I set noise scale to 100 for example and hit play, we will get a much flatter landscape. Check out the next episode and thank you for watching.